today I'm going to share another monsoon uh, recipe as you can have this with your evening snacks with your family tea and lots of atta this chatpata recipe let us try this recipe firstly I'll boil some potatoes and cool it down and now I will add 2 teaspoon of oil into a pan and I'm going to add one large size finely chopped onions and finely chopped garlic around about uh, four to five cloves of garlic and saute this till it is translucent in color we do not want to change the color of the onion and the uh, garlic we'll just saute this till a uh, little bit pinkish you know tran translucent in color and this time your flame should be low and saute this see my color has not changed but it's a little bit of translucent so this is done and now i will switch off the gas and add this into my boiled potatoes and now i will add some green chilies if you do not want to have green chilies then you can skip it and i'm going to add some coriander leaves chopped coriander leaves roasted coriander powder around about one teaspoon of coriander powder half a teaspoon of chili powder salt to taste half a teaspoon of roasted zira powder or cumin powder and mix all the things together now i'm going to mash the potatoes with all those ingredients i'm taking a masher and mash all the potatoes you can use your hands this recipe is really uh, very crispy from outside and from inner it's very soft wonderful mix all everything together and now i'm going to add one teaspoon of lime juice into it and mix it well again we have made ready the heroine and now comes the hero of the recipe and that is um, bread slices i have used here bread slices and i'm going to cut the size of the bread slices and i'm going to dip it into water and squeeze out all the extra water from the bread just uh, take water just dip once and just squeeze out don't dip it much as it will be soggy so squeeze out all the uh, moisture from the bread and set aside now i'm going to take the soaked bread uh, from which we have squeezed out all the water and now i will take the potato i told you it's the heroine and i will wrap with the hero all together see the way we do the way we do the uh, you know the plate pakoras that kind of thing now the, again the second thing i'm showing you and now i will rest it after doing all the breads wrapping with the bread uh, i'm going to uh, keep it in the freezer for about 10 to 15 minutes so that it gets a little bit of stiff wrap it nicely so that the potato doesn't come out from the bread you can use two breads like this to cover it up if your bread is small and now i'm done now i will coat this with uh, vermicelli or roasted uh, savoy i'll just break it with my uh, hands uh, so that it coats well or you can use a roller pin to roll it and break it so that it coats well with the bread uh, roll coat it nicely so that the uh, vermicelli or the savoy uh, coats well with the bread and it will make the bre uh, bread pakora crispy and now i will rest it in the freezer for about 10 to 15 minutes and now i will heat a pan and into it i'm going to fry it in the oil deep fry till it's golden brown in color uh, vermicelli or savinia will make the outer portion of the bread will uh, crispy and when you bite it and it will find uh, soft bread inside with lots of potatoes try these evening snacks and do let me know in the comment section how did you like it and do try to make this sit with your family hot tea or coffee and this bread pakora 
if you like my video do not forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe my channel bye bye